Gary G with the Inland Valley News reporting as the Los Angeles Clippers will prepare to take on the world champion Golden State Warriors. Should be an exciting contest. Stay tuned. Rome here. How are you feeling first no, of all? Feeling good. Feeling good. Well, what is your assessment of the season thus far for you as a rookie? Um, it's been fun so far, just a learning experience, um, you know, just being able to play in the G League and, you know, get a lot of running and then coming back up here and also playing as well, it's been, it's been fun and it's been a great experience. What do you think about a game like tonight? You know, you got the world's champion in tonight. What kind of uh, energy and uh, adrenaline does that bring the, or do you keep it consistent? Uh, I think you want to keep it consistent. I mean, I, I understand that, you know, that they are the defending champions, but you want to look at every game as you're playing to be a champion. So just having that same approach, because um, you want to be on that kind of level is, is something I think you got to go into every game with. So it's important to what, to keep, maintain what, what you've developed and nothing out of the ordinary. Yep, exactly. What do you think your biggest assets is that you've developed since coming into the league? Um, I think I think uh, my shooting ability. You know, a lot of a lot of teams are, you know, three or layup kind of, and um, I think you know me being able to shoot the ball and come in and you know add some of those to our team is, you know, it could be a huge swing um, at points and you know just playing my role and understanding what I have to do is. is uh, you know, I don't know. What would you say the highlight moment thus far has been for you? Any highlights? Or what's what's your highlight? Um, that you, I mean, you know, I would, say, I would say our our first real close game, last game, and seeing Lou, you know, hit that game winning shot, that was that was definitely I think a highlight so far. Especially against a team that's been really hot. Yeah, exactly. And just seeing, you know, it, it goes to the hot hand, or it goes to the hot guy, um, and and it was um, it was it was awesome, awesome. Now, when you're in a game and you you know you. Game is close like that. What is, what is your mentality? What you know? Do you say, well, do I take the shot or do I give it to a vet? Or what, what's your outlook on that? Um, if I was if I was out there, yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, you want to go to Lou in, in that situation. I mean, he's he's a guy that's been known to hit shots, big shots like that, and a go-to guy in those situations. So yes, I think you'd, go, you'd have to go to Lou in that circumstance. Who's been the most encouragement to you thus far? Um, most encouragement so far. I mean, I would probably say I talk a lot with uh, with Avery and uh, Tobias, Lou too as well. But I would, I would say probably Avery and Tobias the most uh, so far. Is that way metal? What do you think as far as the fan fan atmosphere? How is that you know factored into the equation of playing? Because you're playing against probably the most people you've been before probably in your career. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, it's been a lot of fun. I think, um, you know, I've, I've been in a lot of big games with a lot of people before, um, you know, being in college and, you know, those in a lot of arenas that I went to, some of them hold 20,000 plus people too. So um, just kind of staying focused in the game is, is something I think you just got to have going in those situations. All right. Well, close out with a big shout out for yourself and the team. Oh, yeah. Um, big game tonight for the Clippers against, uh, against Golden State today. Uh, go on to get this W. And, before for the season. I used to win. I thought I could be like a fresh out of the pan. Only when I'm taking pics, I'm a middle.